Hello friends, so welcome to our YouTube channel. In this video, we have two circles of equal radius. O is the center of one of the circles. D is the point at which the two circles touch each other. They are touching at point D. So when you join AB, AB is 16 centimeter. Now point of contact, point of contact of two circles will lie at the line joining the two center of the two circles, O and O dash. These are the two centers of the circle. We have to find out the length of AC. What will be the length of AC? And remember that AC and C are equal. AC is the AC is tangent. That is an information which is required. Otherwise, we will not be able to solve this question. AC is the tangent to the circle. So definitely this angle will be 90 degree. A tangent and radius are perpendicular to each other. Let's see how we can solve this question. Let's uh, write down all the data which is given. AB is given as 16 centimeters. And if AB is 16 centimeters, AD is diameter. The two circles have equal radius. It is given that the circles are equal radius. So this diameter will be 8, AD will be 8, and therefore the radius will be 4 each. O is also. Also, it is given that BC is tangent at point E, AC is tangent at point E. So this angle is 90 degrees. This angle is also 90 degrees. Tangent and radius are perpendicular to each other. If you know this, we can take two triangles which are similar. Which two triangles we are talking about? Triangle ABC and triangle OB. In these two triangles, Angle A is 90 degree and angle E is 90 degree. And both have angle ABC and angle EBO common. So if two angles are equal, triangles are similar. The two triangles are similar. And if these two triangles are similar, then the ratio of the sides are also same. So corresponding sides we have to take. Let's take AC. So corresponding side will be OE because both have angle B common. So AC upon OE. The second sides will be taken as opposite to 90 degree. That is the hypotenuse BC. and OB. And the third side of this triangle ACB is AB. And the uh, third side of uh, this triangle is BE. So let's write down the values which we know. We have to calculate AC. So let's write down AC. OE is 4, which is the radius of this circle. So OE is given as 4. BC, B to C, we have, we don't know the value of this. So let us write down this as BC only. And we know the value of OB, hypotenuse OB, 4 plus 8, 12. And AB, A to B is 16. We don't know the value of BE. So let's write down B here. But in triangle OB, we can calculate the value of B. OB square is equal to OE square plus B E square, right angle triangle, Pythagoras theorem we can apply. OB is 12, OE is 4. We have to calculate B. 12 square is 144. 4 square is 16 BE square. 
144 minus 16 will be 128 BE square. Now, this is equals to 64 user. And the square root of 64 is 8, square root of 2 is root 2. So the length of B is 8 root 2. We can put the value here and we can get the value of AC. AC upon 4, BC upon 12, 16 upon 8 root. We have calculated the value of B. Now from first and the last one, we can get the value of AC 4. 16 upon 8 root 2, cross multiplication. So AC is 16 upon 8 root 2 into 4, 4 to the 8, 2 8 is the 16, 8 upon root 2. Multiply and divide by root 2, you get 8 root 2 upon 2, that is 4 root 2. The value of AC is 4 under root 2, and similarly from this we can get the value of C also. So I hope friends you like this video. Please like our videos and subscribe to our channel.